LAX 18 called the Lexington mayoral race early. Linda Gordon won convincingly with 63% of the vote, defeating Ronnie Baston to lead Lexington into the future. LAX 18's Angie Bevan covered Gordon's win tonight. That continues our LAX 18 Decision 2018 coverage. <laughs> Pure joy in the moments immediately after the race was called. I'm really, really excited and just, I, I'm so happy with it. Oh. As the news sunk in, one word described Linda Gorton, gracious. I look around here and almost all of you had a hand in my campaign. A decisive win for the one-time district council member, then at-large council member, and then vice mayor. I am thrilled by this victory. I didn't expect the numbers to be what they are. In her acceptance speech, Gorton said opponent Ronnie Bastin called to congratulate her and let her know he's here to help. And she says she's ready to roll up her sleeves and get to work, from tackling drugs and crime to growing the economy. I'm convinced that under my leadership, Lexington will continue to grow as a hub for high-tech jobs in business and agriculture. In closing, Gorton said she is proud of the positive, upbeat, policy-oriented campaign she ran. Covering the news in Lexington, Angie Bevan, LEX 18 News. Gorton's opponent, former Lexington Police Chief Ronnie Baston, conceded the race shortly after 7 o'clock tonight. And he's pledged to do everything he can to support Gorton in her new role. Baston told his supporters it was an honor to run. He also said it was an honor to have served the city of Lexington for nearly 40 years, first as a police officer, then chief, and most recently as public safety commissioner. Despite losing, he said his devotion to Lexington will never change. Though we didn't come out on top tonight, I'm so proud of the race that we did run. We worked hard, we put people first, and we kept our values first and foremost. Baston thanked his supporters for putting their trust in him, telling the crowd he hopes to continue to serve the city and its people in any capacity he can.